Okay, this is Mark Davis with uh, Precision Race Engines, and uh, we're dyno testing and tuning a uh, LSX uh, engine, Brodix CNC ported heads, and for a customer of ours, and it's got the uh, four liter uh, Whipple charger. Uh, we've done had this run in here. This is the second day this engine's been on the dyno. Uh, had it on there yesterday, and still tuning on it today using the fast XFI. Uh, fuel injection for the controller and the XIM box for the ignition system and uh, we've done made five or six dyno pulls on this thing and with the uh, uh, pulley set up its own here been break bro broke the engine in got the tune up on it and uh, we're uh, we'll make another dyno pull here for the video here in a minute it's been making it's been making consistently over 900 horse on 93 octane pump gas every time so far so don't seem to have any detonation issues uh, so we'll uh, we're gonna do that then we'll we'll do some pulley changes actually probably do a slow it slow the blower down a little bit and do a milder tune for the customer uh, got a feeling it's gonna probably be a little more than the vehicle is gonna want anyway so and then and then after that we'll actually put some racing fuel in this thing and then we'll put some smaller pulleys on top and speed the blower up. See, we're going to see if we can bust, bust a thousand horsepower with this thing, which I think should be very doable because we're done uh, over 900 on pump gas. So, so we got the, it's got the uh, water to air intercooler and stuff in it. That's what the green hoses there are. They're uh, just f feeding fresh water through there to cool, cool the air charge down. So anyway, we'll go here and see if we can fire this thing up and let, let it warm up a little.
right there, we made 951 horsepower at 6,500 and 825 foot pounds of torque at 5,800. That's actually been our best pull on it so far on 93 octane pump, pump gas. See, the torque curve is pretty flat. Uh, little glitch right here, but I think that's more of a bobble on the torque, torque sensor than it is actually in the engine. We'll do, uh, we'll do a pulley swap and then we'll do our lower horsepower pull here in a minute and uh, should get us down there maybe around 800, 800 feet. Got the uh, pulley changed. We went from a four and a quarter. We actually went up on the top pulley to slow the lower down some. Went to a four and a half. Uh, I'm going to try to do a little bit milder tune on it. Uh, we'll, see, we'll see what it do, does with that. Okay, didn't hurt the power as much as we thought. Went down, slowed the blower down, and still made 903 horse at 6,500 and 769 foot pounds of torque at 4,500. And our, see, our boost level lost about two pounds, a pound and a half, lost about a pound, pound and a half of boost. Okay, we've got the uh, Small pulley on there, the three and uh, seven eighths inch put top pulley uh, should give us a couple more pounds of boost, and we got racing fuel in it, so we're gonna see see how much this picks it up.
pull right there, we made a thousand and twenty-one horsepower, a sixty-five hundred and eight hundred and fifty-five foot-pounds of torque at five thousand. Let's see how much boost we made. All pressure good. Making good about 12, 12 pounds of boost. <laughs> 